Welcome to the Start It, Own It, Finish It podcast with Dat Boy Mo 629. Discussing everything fitness and everything motivation. Here is where you will get your fitness education and motivational fix. Now, here's your host, Dat Boy Mo 629. <clears throat> huh. What's going on, everybody? It's that boy Mo Six Two Nine coming to y'all with another edition of the Started Only and Finish It podcast. Mind you, I apologize. Whew, shit. I am recording this in my garage, my garage gym, because the gym they're closed, and uh, I am on my elliptical. Basically, to prove that you can do a podcast anywhere you damn well want to, anytime you want to, if you put your mind to it. So let's get to it. All right, today's episode is going to be about the law of attraction and speaking things into existence. Ooh, bear with me, damn. Ha. Ah, I should have uh, turned down the intensity. I've been on this thing for about. 14 minutes, 12 seconds, and I decided to do a podcast, very smart mode, but anyway, law of attraction. For those who don't believe or understand what the law of attraction is, law of attraction is, basically, if you believe it, you will see it. If you think it, if you manifest it, it will come to you, whatever it is. So if you manifest, I don't know, failure all the time, you will fail. If you manifest money, you will get money. If you manifest love, somewhere down the line you will receive love. Now, that doesn't necessarily mean you're going to get it today, tomorrow, next week, in a month, or in a year. But... And I'm going to recommend uh, this book called The Secret. And this is all about the law of attraction. Woo! Ha! Man, I'm I'm getting the hell fucking workout in. But anyway, woo! Uh, Law of attraction means if you manifest it in your mind, think about it, manifest on it, pray upon it, I'm not getting religious here, but pray up on it. What you desire, what you want, will eventually come your way. Now, it's easy to get caught up in failure. It's easy to get caught up in low self-esteem. It's easy to get caught up in the BS around you because you don't see it in front of you right now. There are many people out there Successful people that will vouch that if you manifest it, if you want it, claim it, it can be yours. Denzel Washington, one of them. He said, claim it, own it, it can be yours. Will Smith is another one. Claim it, own it, it can be yours. Why not you? But you yourself is not going to fall in your lap. It's not just going to come to you without you putting in the work. Don't just sit there and say, I want a good man. I want a good woman. I want a good job. I want a great career. I want to own a multi-million dollar business. And thinking that if you just sit down, sit around and wish and wish and wish, it'll come to you. You have to put in the effort to do it. You have to put in the effort to claim it, to own it to receive it, be prepared for the day when it comes to you, that you're ready to claim it, own it, and then do what you can with it without letting it slip from your grip. One of the reasons why I'm sitting here on this elliptical, talking to you guys, doing a podcast, in a garage is to show that I'm still getting in the workout. I'm still doing a podcast because 
I bought this damn elliptical. I have a garage and I have a phone with a microphone in it. And I have the determination and the discipline to come out here and do this podcast today to make sure you listen, have something to listen to, give you content for this podcast. That's what I really want to show to you guys, because this is live. This is not just me uh, wondering, man, I, I want my podcast to be successful, so I'm just going to wait and hope it be successful. No, my podcast has not grown over the last year because I have not consistently created content. So I need to look in the mirror, look at myself, kick my own ass, be like, man, get the content in, dog. Because you're not going to grow unless you create content. You're not going to grow unless you create value. So I decided, well, actually in the middle of, when I was 14 minutes in, I was like, you know what, man, just create a podcast today. Do create an episode and talk to the people so they can see where your head's at. I mean, lately, I'm not gonna lie, hell, doing the COVID 19 thing, lately, like, like, like a lot of y'all, man, depression kicks in, uncertainty, low self esteem, self doubt, all kicks in. But there's not one successful person out there that's a billionaire, multi billionaire. Millionaire, multi-millionaire that has not had a day of self-doubt, low depression, I mean high depression, low self-esteem. But they looked in the mirror. If they needed it, they, they seek some help, professional help, or comfort from a friend. And they got out of their own head to get to where they want to be so they can get back to the world, help make the world a better place. So if you out there, if you're listening to this, and you got some self-doubt, you got some low self-esteem, get out your own head. I don't care if you got to go online to get a therapist. I don't care if you got to reach out to a friend you haven't talked to in a long time. Do it. Because what you have, what you can give to the world, is more than you can ever imagine. You just got to get off your own ass and do it, man. And do it. If you got dreams, you got goals. If you're still breathing, if you're still kicking, you can do it, man. I'm telling you right now. With me, I, I'm doing it. I'm not, I don't have millions of fans right now. I don't have millions of viewers and listeners. But 10, 10 different people listening, that's enough for me right now. I'm not gonna lie, if it's 20, 30, 40, somebody's listening, and I hope one person at least gets something out of it. That's enough for me. Because at the end of the day, to me, it's about the life you impact and you change if you can just do it by getting off your own ass and kicking your own ass. I met the Ultimate Warrior in 2013. 2027 years later, his message stuck with me, it sticks with me, that everybody has greatness within them. You just have to get it out of you. And then show everyone else they have greatness within them and get it out of them. And it spreads like wildfire. Maybe that's the message that COVID-19 is really trying to show us and teach us. As quick as this disease can spread, your message and spread just as fast if you do it right. Until next time, I think my workout's almost over. I got about eight more minutes left, but you get the message. Till next time, start it, own it, finish it. You've been listening to the Start It, Own It, Finish It podcast. Be sure to subscribe to receive new episodes. Link up with DatBoyMo629 on Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube. Or visit him at aceonewarrior.com. Until next time, start it, own it, finish it.